Bellar Sida Cardifolia is very well known to Im uh, boost immunity. The word Bala uh, roughly translates to strengthen immunity uh, in the body. Shirvana Thaila, I've seen many uh, practitioners using it in like a autoimmune thyroid, thyroiditis where there is immune correction is required or in cases where immunity boosting is also required, it is uh, used. So it definitely seems to have some effect on immunity as well, sir. De definitely, definitely it has a role on uh, immunity to play, particularly where uh, drug for Bala, which is also once again used as a Vatahara Dravya and potent Vatahara Dravya and also Pit so whenever there is an involvement of Vata and Pitta and such diseases were manifested, it may be any autoimmune disorder, then there is along with any other our, um, drugs of uh, immunity boosters, whatever we speak about like Ashwagandha and all those things, this combination also go, holds good. Many a times we come across that's the reason we use it uh, Ashwagandha Balarista so in these conditions to improve our, uh, our immunity act you know, part of it. But as a Kshira Bala when we are using it, it is as a tissue builder, basically for the where there is a shaya or the reduction of the tissues or tissue loss is there. It may be any sort of tissue, it may be asti or bone, it may be majja or it may be mamsa or kandara, sira, whatever it may be ligament or even uh, what you call uh, tendons, all these things where there is these type of uh, material that have been uh, deprived or uh, reduced in their um, uh, quantum or the, their nature are their strength. So in those areas, as a drug of choice, we can use this and this gives a wonderful results in these areas rather than any uh, particularly for the immunity. We need to blend in case of immunity. So in order to um, provide an immunity uh, boosting effect, we may have to even go with the Amlaki or Guduchi or Kalamega, something like that we have to need to add to this to give an effect of that or Ashwagandha, something like that. Yeah, so this is kind of a Shirabala Thaila is uh, a multifaceted uh, medicine which has its own indications but it also can say gel well with other set of medicines to bring about uh, a versatile other actions also and uh, you said that you know it, it, it is combined with bala and ashwagandha and then uh, arista is prepared out of that and if there is also we have this uh, bala ashwagandha di taila also this is usually used in uh, improving the muscle strength as in case of muscle wasting paralysis etc externally so there Ashwagandha would, uh, you know, strengthen the muscles, tissues, tendons and Bala would uh, improve the nerve strength. So, it, uh, Bala is very commonly used to uh, improve the nerve strength, nerve regeneration or at least strengthening the, uh, re or rebuilding the myelin sheath in that purposes. Yeah, definitely. It is in those areas, it is a very wonderful drug as a combination, Bala, Ashwagandha, as well as even uh, many times we come across even Dashamula in a uh, supporting manner, it also helps in the uh, improving of the nerve uh, endings or even you can say myelin coating or whatever it is. So it helps in conduction of nerve functioning in a better manner. So and even also um, uh, neuropathies or any pain or neuralgias, such type of conditions, Bala, Ashwagandha, Vidari and these type of drugs, they do a very wonderful role, uh, they will play. Of course, Kshirabala is one of the combination we use in the, those conditions.